in the cow yard on a sunny day. This is a trout. No, that's a common shiner, isn't it? We gotta keep this guy, because we're gonna do a catch and cook of common shiner. Sweet, we got a new species. Too bad I don't, do I have anything good to put him in? Now I need to catch a model scalp, and we better try fishing with a night crawler actually now. We're gonna go bigger. So this is a very small specimen of this species, but I'm removing, and I don't know how many of these I'm going to catch there. So we got ourselves a common shiner, and our lighting in our living room. Our big light is broke in our kitchen right now. So, I don't even think I actually gutted this. So what we're going to do is we're going to rinse this common shiner off. We're about as bad as Tim Gale high outdoors. And we're just going to take a little tiny piece of tin foil and wrap it up in it and put a little salt and pepper on it. And we got the grill going. We're actually grilling trout, but here's some salt. Here's some garlic. And where's the pepper? Here's some pepper. And I'm going to wrap this up all nice so it doesn't dry out. And we're going to take it up to the grill. And the grill's outside, it's dark out. It's going to dark up too early. So we're going off to check on the grill. We got Captain George sitting right there. It's going pretty good. Everything seems to be cooking. My veggies look done. I better go and get a hot pan. And my stuff look my meat looks done. There's not gonna be much meat on this shiner. So we're going to unroll our tin foil. Hopefully we're still recording. Here's what our little fish looks like. We better take the bite out of it. I don't think I've eaten these before. Here's what the filet looks like. I think I'm just going to eat it with the scales and everything. Tastes kind of like cat food. Actually, it just tastes like fish. It's not that bad. If I was in a survival situation, I'd eat it. Now the question is, what does he think about it? So here's the George. There's the fish on the ground. There he's taking a bite. It must not taste too bad. It just cooks. It tastes like cooked fish. It's maybe a little greasy. It's not too bad. It's a little stronger flavored, golden like a trout or something. So I don't know. Worthwhile trying. And if I was dying, I'd eat it. And then the bones like falling apart. And there's some little bones in it. Though that's a downside. I would only advise to eat these if I was in a survival situation. I don't feel like messing with the rest of the fish scene as I have better fish to eat. That's it for this catching cook. But George wants more fish. Just love a minute. 